overview of the food processing industry. Food processing is the method of converting agricultural produce into intermediary or finished foods, which are safe for consumption. They could be processed foods, ready to eat foods, food additives, or food used to prepare other food products. It includes numerous primary activities like slicing, grading, or freezing, as well as secondary activities like pasteurization and packaging. Food processing also focuses on food preservation as a method of enhancing the shelf life and quality of processed foods. The food processing industry in India is divided into several subsectors. They are dairy, fruit and vegetable processing, grains and cereals, fisheries, meat and poultry processing, bread and bakery, consumer foods, food materials go through to become final consumable products for various customers. Overview of the food grain milling subsector. Every year India produces more than 200 million tons of different food grains like rice, wheat, maize, barley and millets like jawar, bajra and ragi. The food grain milling process differs according to the raw material used and the finished product. Grain Mill Operator Introduction to Food Grain Milling Process Let us see the broad steps involved in the food grain milling process. Reception, Preliminary Cleaning and Storage Food grains arrive at mill elevators by truck, rail, barge or ship and are transferred by conveyors to the elevator head house. Preliminary cleaning occurs prior to storage. After cleaning, the wheat is conveyed to storage bins. As grain is needed for milling, it is withdrawn from the storage elevator and conveyed to the mill area. Cleaning In the mill area, grain is first sent through a cleaning operation. This section of a mill is called the cleaning house. In the cleaning house, dust and smaller pieces of foreign material are removed from the grain. Impurities are removed from grain based on size, specific gravity, shape, air resistance and inherent differences in material. Example, metal, stone. Tempering or conditioning. Modern milling practices utilize conditioning or tempering before the grain is ground. This involves adding water to grain to raise the moisture of hard grain. After moisture is added, the grain lies in tempering bins or drying units for desired hours. Tempering softens or mellows the endosperm, making it easier to grind. Milling the milling of grain to flour is done with a series of roller mills. The roller milling system comprises of brake rolls and reduction rolls. The surface of the brake roll is corrugated whereas surface of the reduction roll is smooth. In the brake rolls, the barn is cracked and the kernel is opened. After each break, the mixture of free bran, free endosperm, free germ is passed through the next break roll while the middle sized endosperm called middlings are sent to the reduction rolls for grinding of free millings into proper flour size. Packaging, storage and shipment of finished product. Packaging the end product is a work intensive processing step and hence automated as much as possible. In Europe, North America and Australia, the majority of milling products are filled into trucks as a bulk product. In Latin America, Africa and Asia, bagging into open mouth 
or valve bags is predominant. These bags are filled and palletized. The pallets are then transferred to the warehouse from where they are loaded onto road vehicles for dispatch. Transfer of the finished product to storage, bagging or bulk loading is generally done by pneumatic conveying systems. Bulk storage capacity varies widely, but mostly mills have bulk flour storage from 2 to 4 days. Grain Mill Operator Code FIC Q1003 NSQF Level 3 Version 2 Now let's talk about career progression for Grain Mill Operator. A Grain Mill Operator can obtain training for Chief Miller at a higher NSQF level as vertical progression and increase his, her, scope in the milling subsector by adding more product portfolio in the existing catalogue or can make himself or herself eligible to work in all kinds of serial based milling units. Let's talk about the aspirational factors for grain mill operator. After completing the training in grain mill operator course, a person can do a variety of work or start small scale self-owned milling units in the local area. He, she can add a variety of milling products in their milling units such as wheat, rice, pulses and millets. Grain milling is one of the best businesses in the food processing sector and consumers from all sects of life need milled grains in their daily meals. By establishing a milling unit, one can achieve high level of success in their career and can maintain good social connections and reputation in the local market. You can also apply for job profiles of grain mill operator or chief millers in MNC units or local milling units after completing this training. As you know, India is one of the highest grains and cereals producing country and people are also moving towards a healthy diet. So the scope in the coming future for this subsector is very high. Thank you.